Hi, I'm Ben with UMT360. Better informed investment decisions are key to improving your organization's project and program performance. So what's holding you back? Most organizations suffer from a reliance on disconnected systems and inadequate tools, like error-prone and difficult-to-govern Excel spreadsheets, ERP systems that can't provide comprehensive reporting on projects or programs, and PPM tools that lack sophisticated financial management capabilities. Organizations can close these gaps by integrating UMT360 with Microsoft Project Online or Project Server, resulting in financial management best practices and controls across the project and portfolio management lifecycle. This eliminates the need for Excel as organizations move beyond custom fields and cost resources to gain complete financial transparency and insight. Let's take a look at how UMT360 can help you standardize financial structures to consolidate cost and benefit data, establish financial governance controls across the PPM lifecycle, manage multiple currencies, and record snapshots to maintain an auditable record of project and program data. So let's take a look at how easy it is to integrate financial information into Project Server. If I open up the UMT360 settings, it's easy here to configure financial structures, establish the governance controls, and manage multi-currencies. Very easy to define and manage financial structures. Here, if I open the cost structure that's been defined, you can define a hierarchical cost structure and add nodes as needed. It's also easy to manage allocation centers. Again, you can define a simple or complex organizational hierarchy here and capture the cost centers or allocation centers associated to each department. Next, let's take a look at how easy it is to establish the governance controls at different stages in the workflow. So by opening up this enterprise project type here in Project Server, I can see the key workflow stages they're going to govern this project. So it's easy to drill down and establish the financial rules and controls for this stage and other stages. In this instance, I can specify the level of financial information that must be completed at this stage. I can force transition actions like creating an auditable snapshot. I can even specify the behavior for each of the financial structures. For cost here, we're displaying information to the user on a quarterly basis and at level two within the financial structure defined. It's also easy to confirm where you want the resource cost to be aggregated from, whether you're using a resource plan or the schedule by stage in the workflow. UMT360 also allows you to manage multiple currencies. Very easy to come in here, establish an enterprise currency, and then create additional currencies. If I open up Euro here, I can come in and capture the currency rates on a time phase basis. So having seen how easy it is to establish the financial management structures and controls in UMT360, let's now look at a project in action. If I open up the Innovation Management Framework project in Project Server, you'll see this project is early in the stages of its life cycle. It's in, in the defined stage. If I open up the cost estimate view here, I can see the, the financial structure that has been defined. Notice we're displaying the information to the user on a quarterly basis and at level two within the financial structure, but of course it's easy to drill down to capture more information. Because we're able to manage multiple currencies, I can now look at information in euros versus the enterprise currency, which was dollars. Can also break down the cost of the project by allocation center. So going to the allocation centers here, it's easy to capture a funding allocation by department and allocation center on a percentage basis. So the project's now moved into the select gate. UMT360 can take auditable snapshots of the project metadata. If I open up the snapshot view here in the ribbon, you can see that an automatic snapshot was created um, as we moved into this phase. The snapshot has been configured to record the current cost and benefit estimates for this project. So that gives you a sense of how UMT360 can integrate financial management best practices and controls with Microsoft Project Server. 
UMT360 is the only enterprise portfolio management solution built on SharePoint. So you get seamless integration with Microsoft Project Online and Project Server, and even more value from your Microsoft platform investment. Want to know more? Connect with us at umt360.com and we'll be happy to show you how easy it is to transform the way you manage your product, business capability, program, IT asset and project portfolios.